here's an interesting fact. The Academy of Management has 26 divisions and interest groups, and half of us members of the Academy have joined three or more of them. I am Herman Aguinez from the George Washington University, and I have the honor and the privilege of serving as your Academy of Management President. In this installment of the President's Corner, I am delighted to highlight the amazing opportunities that our 26 divisions and interest groups offer to all of us members. Why are DIGs so important for AOM? Let me offer an analogy. Our membership in the Academy of Management is like living in a big city that offers many opportunities, but sometimes it is not easy to make personal connections and friends in a big city. So all of us join DIGs, which are like the neighborhoods in our big city. We know it is often easier to make connections with those in our own neighborhood particularly when we share the same research and teaching interests. As the Academy of Management President, I can objectively, very objectively say that each of the 26 divisions and interest groups are truly fantastic. But you don't have to believe what I am saying. You can just watch what I do. I am a member of 11 divisions. This is how much I personally believe in the value of joining multiple digs. I am sure you know that there are many divisions that are very large, like strategy, OB, OMT, HR, entrepreneurship, and research methods. But there are also smaller divisions like management history, organization development and change, healthcare management, public and nonprofit, and organizational neuroscience. So there is something for every AOM member, regardless of whether we are interested in micro or micro domains, quantitative or qualitative methods or anything in between. Speaking of organizational neuroscience, it is the latest addition to the DIG portfolio. Although our first nine divisions were created half a century ago in 1971, we continue to add new ones based on members' interests. Management scholarship and education continue to evolve. So the Academy of Management must also adapt to make sure we serve the interests of all of our members. So we continue to build more neighborhoods. <laughs> Why is it a good idea for you to join multiple digs? Because each one offers different services and opportunities to connect with others and improve our research and teaching skills. For example, some offer virtual workshops that help develop research skills. Others organize networking events, focusing on career building, and yet others offer student services for job hunting. I'll tell you a secret that relates to what I think is yet one more and very, very important reason and benefit of joining multiple digs. Because I am a member of 11, I get to attend as many as 11 receptions at our annual meeting, and I can't wait for our next in-person conference. There are so many innovative things that the digs are doing right now that is truly fantastic. I apologize that I can only mention a few right now, but I could have picked dozens more. For example, the International Management Division posted recordings of its webinar series featuring ideas and practical support for international business teaching especially in a post-pandemic world. As a second example, the Entrepreneurship Division created a podcast series called Student Forward that is for the students and by the students. And the Healthcare Management Division, just another example, recently launched a new webinar series that opened with a panel session focused on bridging the divide between research and practice. So the DIGs have adapted to the pandemic and not only continue to offer services, but have actually enhanced services by using online tools. With these new initiatives, the DIGs are offering services to more members than ever. And regardless of time zones, practically 24 seven and certainly year round. We often say that the DIGs are the heart of the academy. I want to thank all of you who volunteer for our digs because the services our members receive would be impossible without your engagement. So thank you. And for those of you 
who would like to join a dig or volunteer for a dig, please visit aom.org slash network. That is aom.org slash network and click on the digs link. You will be able to read about each of the 26 divisions and interest groups, what they do, who the leaders are, and how to get in touch with them to participate in events or also to volunteer. In this President's Corner series, I will continue to share updates and also seek your input on various initiatives. I very much look forward to our ongoing shared journey. The sky's the limit. Until next time.